Oh hey, welcome. Uh, we are going to get back into the Outer Worlds today. Uh, this is going to be part two of... I have no idea how many parts. Um, so let's just jump right back into it. something or other. Alex? Captain Alex. Alright, that's good enough. Got a little bit. Oh, hey. Hey, guys. Say, this wouldn't happen to be your ship, would it? Because uh, you sure walked in it like it was your ship. And if this ship is yours, well, mister, you owe Spacer's Choice a hefty fine. I'm afraid we gotta dock your pay. I don't have a job. Try lying. See if that works. Oh, by the law. I'm so sorry. I had no idea we had an inspector coming. Ha. If you'd like to speak with my manager, I report to Constable Reyes in Edgewater. Edgewater's not too far. Just follow the road east of here, over past the cemetery. That's right. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to inspect the crime scene before I make my report. Yep. Report. That you, you do that. How do we put away... I forgot everything. It's been so long since we've played. That's not helpful. I'm not playing on that. Oh, yeah. All right, we'll just figure it out. Okay, well, that's reload. Don't know. Oh, okay. Let's run. Okay. Sneaky, sneaky, sneak. I think that was that. Yeah, it was. got us to the map so inventory to yep 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 okay it's all coming back to me now Ooh, let's do that how do i can i just yeah i can just drag it all right well let's make you three then why not Nothing. You pooping? Is that what's happening? What are you, what, what are you, what are you doing? I'm just checking out the rock. <laughs> well, do you smell what the rock is cooking? Hey. If you don't get that reference, you're too young. Oh gosh, he found me. Okay. Out of sneaky state mode. In the face! Hey. 
<laughs> Juvenile. Okay. Let's get going. This world is really pretty. Edgewater! Yay! You think I'd be able to run more than two seconds? Also, how do we put away our weapon? Z. <laughs> T. Nope. Y. Nope. U. I. That's apparently item repair. Alright, that's good to know. O. P. L. K. Nope. J. H space B Oh no F is heal okay E I have no idea how to Whoa hey that away, but... where'd you come from? Came from your mom's house <laughs> Don't go ambling out in those hills. That's marauder territory, friend. Not anymore. Killed them bitches. Head, you don't know you not talk a too pretty for a marauder. Most of them just grunt and yell. Ain't safe out here. You'd best head into town. Avail yourself of Edgewater's high walls and low, low prices. Ooh. I'm being vigilant. Don't want to get blindsided by some corpse-chewing marauder come stalking out the shadows. You're telling me there are cannibals out there? Oh, worse. Unemployed cannibals. You no. ever seen a marauder hold down a job? Or put a stake into society? Ugh, terrible. Pleased to make your acquaintanceship. I'd shake your hand, but I've been hauling corpses. You don't want none of that on you. No Name's Silas. Junior in humor for the town of Edgewater. We're all part of the Spacer's Choice family. Hey, I earned that fancy title. <laughs> Started off a lowly junior gravesite builder, then junior interment engineer. No! Oh. And I was a junior burial assistant for a time. Alrighty. You seem pretty old to be a junior anything. The rate I've been working, I'm bound to earn a promotion. Must be about 50, 60 burials away from associate in humor. Alright, everybody's gotta have goals. Definitely not the junior in humor, that's for sure. If you've got business inquiries, you should stop by Reed Thompson's office. He's up in the tower above the cannery. Head into town, follow the road. Look, you obviously ain't a worker. W what's your racket? You a smuggler? Freelancer? None of your business. I do what I want. Got a knack for being discreet like? There's money to be made, long as you keep your nose clean. Edgewater is a company town, board owned and operated. That includes the cemetery. None of us own our grave sites, we rent them from the company. Renting means money. Money means paperwork. Paperwork means signatures. Some of our families become a mite delinquent in paying their dues, you see. Have they now? That. Four workers still haven't paid up. Phyllis, Conrad, Ludwig, and Martin Abernathy. He's a special case. You may want to twist his arm a little. Oh, I'll do the arm twisty twisty. But why is he a special case? He just is. Look, I don't want to get into it. Just make sure he pays up. Interesting. Conrad's got a barbershop in town. Phyllis works at the cannery most hours. Abernathy, I ain't seen him in a few days. His domicile is near the cannery. You'll find him in town. All except Ludwig, that is. He's over by the landing pad. 
Yeah? This town must be in pretty bad shape if it's keeping you up. You could look at it that way, I suppose. You could look at us and say, those Edgewater saps lost near every soul to plague. But you'd be wrong. We're survivors. Loyal company folk, brave in the wilds. Okay. You're not worried about falling sick. How long have you been... How long have you been a junior in humor, gravedigger, whatever? How long Hang have you been on. at this, man? I'm doing some math in my head. Uh, 20, 30, 31, uh, all my life. Work's been real good to me. Fresh air, exercise, only problem is the paperwork. Can't get anybody to pay their gravesite fees. Maybe because they're dead? Former people, yeah. Marauder's been raiding my graves, you see. Hence the armed guards. Right, because you think they're cannibals. Flesh gnawing, marrow sipping creatures of pure depravity they are. If those marauders swipe any more bodies out of my cemetery, the company's gonna duck my pay. Interesting. Alright, thanks. You're a little creepy, dude. Your head isn't even attached. That's weird. Oh, hello. Nothing to see here, just walking out of someone's house. Totally my house, I mean. Uh, okay, thanks, bye. All the shovels. Then no one will have shovels but me. Nice town you got here. You Keep your distance, friend. Sick house is no place for a traveler. I do what I want.
I appreciate the company and all, but you really ought to leave. You don't want to be seen around me. I go where I want. Hey, keep it down. That kind of talk's bound to put sights on the both of us. I'm in about as much trouble as I can be. No reason you ought to be tarnished by association. People are gonna talk. What's going Figured on here? it was obvious. I got sick. Couldn't get better on my own. Got moved here for everyone's sake. Maybe you don't know this, but there's a real simple reason you don't talk to the plagued. You don't want what we've got. Don't. Take a look here. Please. I could get into a lot of trouble. Uh, you obviously That's need help. kind of you to say, I suppose. But I don't need help. What I need is to understand my own folly. Company always tells us weak spirits lead to weak bodies. This company's dumb. But I didn't want to fall sick with plague. Maybe I should have worked harder. Ugh. Maybe I should have taken more pride in my work. Gross. Can't blame yourself. I really wish you wouldn't say those sorts of things. I told you once already. People could be listening. I told you once already. I'm feeling I a do touch what I faint. Want. If you don't mind, I'd like to be alone for a spell. Uh, do I want to steal from the sick? Nah. What the heck are you? Here, yo. <laughs> it's not stealing, it says, so. Alright. What was that? Whoa. Oh, I thought you were shooting at me. No, not the cute little things. Not the sprat. Oh, the poor, the poor sprat. All right, there's so much to do here. All right, we're gonna cut that short for now I have uh, some stuff I have to do uh, but then I will be back later hopefully and play a little bit more all right we're gonna jump right back into it uh, I'm sure as you can tell it is a different day uh, I had some stuff I had to do uh, at the end of the last playthrough that I didn't realize I had to do so soon uh, so that was a little short so I decided to just kind of add to this video um, so let's continue exploring Edgewater. So let's see what's going on in here. A barber shop? Please don't touch anything. Your hands are probably crawling with germs. Physical hygiene recapitulates moral hygiene. Cleanliness is next to lawfulness. You gonna catch these hands is what I'm trying to say. Relax, clean. Do your hiccups usually come with free lectures? Yes, I can show you my hands. No, thank you. That's quite all right. I've seen enough body parts in my line of work. I'm Conrad. You will report to me if your hair fails to meet Spacer's Choice aesthetic standards. You will also report to me in the event of your death. Whereupon, I will clean and prepare your remains for interment. Thanks. Oh, Conrad. You owe me some dues, bro. Ah, gravesite fees. Silas and I had talked about this at length. I thought I'd made it clear my pecuniary situation precludes the necessary restitutions. You mean you broke. 
As broke as pie crust, friend. Bitless, indigent, destitute. I simply cannot afford it. I am a blemish on the prosperity of our fair settlement. When I expire, I expect Silas to toss my body into a ditch. Oh, okay then. That's <laughs> some quality drama, comrade. You should audition. Yeah. Thank you, no. I despise the cereals. Tell Silas I can't afford to pay. And that I fully expect to have my medical rights revoked for this dereliction. With my apologies. Hang on, medical rights? Some time ago, I fell ill with the plague. By the grace of the law, and through my own hard work, I had proven worthy of treatment. Frankly, I don't imagine I'll earn that right a second time. The barber work hasn't been profitable, you see. I've had to keep this old place running with my own savings. Just give him an IOU. Not a bad idea. But I'd need some kind of collateral. My pair of lucky clippers! No, that won't do. Your idea intrigues me, but I'm afraid I don't have anything to give Silas. I'm open to suggestions. I'll let you know if I think of anything. Much obliged. Yeah, now you don't want to talk shit about my hands, do you? Mm, I can't steal in front of him. <laughs> That's probably a bad idea. Let's just move on. What the? Oh, right, right, right. He works with the dead bodies. Can you see me? No. All right. Steal everything. Ugh. This dude shot himself with destruction of property of company pol company property. That's gross. The body price? Oh, this company is terrible. They're gonna pawn off his teeth. I'm sorry, wait, what? His gold teeth are heirlooms passed down? What? This is terrible. I'm pretty sure Phyllis is one of the people who owes me. Alright, Phyllis. Coming to find you next. Fine butt. Oh, you can definitely see me. Oh well. You trying to get us all in What do you think you're doing? I do what I want. <laughs> there you go. Whatever I want. I don't have time for this. Exactly. We won't do that again. I was just curious what would happen. Now I know. Another day at the cannery. Don't go knocking your work. At least we've got work. Just residents. I was looking for someone at the cannery, so we'll, uh, take a look at that. You just um, It's not the market. best choice, it's Spacer's choice. And before you ask, I'm all out of deluxe salt tuna. All I've got is gourmet. I see what you're selling. Music to my ears. <laughs> Ooh, got lots of stuff to sell. All right, let's see. So that's a healing enhancer. Ammunition. Oh, we can sell this extra. How do I sell? Oh, eat. There we go. Okay. I don't know what a lot of these things like are good for yet. So we'll only sell the things that are extra. 
feel like I can figure out more. Like, what I need. Alright. Oh, wait, can I sell? Is there others? Oh, that's just everything. Okay. What else do we have here? Restricted stock. Okay. Ooh, new clothes. Okay. Hmm. Alright, maybe let's sell some more stuff. Why not? I guess it can't hurt, right? Well, if I have that face thing, do I really need these? Oh, I guess I can just sell them their, their shovels back. for now no 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 let me not let me not be reckless let's just leave it for now I don't know you. Okay. We don't welcome trouble. I don't know what you're about, but this here is a Spacer's Choice drinking establishment. We're all loyal, hardworking company folk here. And what a fine establishment it is. You really think so? <laughs> That's kind of you. I've been trying to keep the floors clean. You got no idea how long it takes to scrub the tiles. Hmm. Guess I misreckoned you. Sorry about that. Yep. I didn't mean to be curt. We just got some problems lately. I can get you a drink if you'd like. Gotta ask you to enjoy your beverage within the premises, though. Can't risk you bringing a drink over to those deserters. You understand. Deserters? <laughs> Traitors. The lot of them. Bunch of folks decided they were tired of working and went out into the wilds to fend for their own selves. Town's already struggling to make quotas, even without that band of slackwits abandoning their posts. Bunch of lazy, shiftless rung leeches. Anyway, enough about them. What can I do for you? Alrighty. I'll talk to Reed. Where can I find him? Do you now? And what makes you think Mr. Thompson wants to talk to you? He's a busy man. If you want to talk to Mr. Thompson, try ignoring your duties. He'll summon you up to that great big tower atop the cannery, and you'll get yourself a proper dressing down. I don't have any duties. say that like it's a good thing it is a good thing if you're not pulling your weight you don't deserve to live here simple as that Alrighty. something else i want to ask go you. ahead so what's your story what have i told you i got shot into space by a crazy scientist i was wondering if you knew anything about the hope Let's see does anybody know anything about that she seems young though i don't know if she's gonna know anything the Hope? No. I've never mixed a drink by that name. Yeah, see. Just I could get up. you a rum and something if you like. Wait, no. Never mind. We're all out of something. Oh, just rum then? Yeah, let me not, let me not stir up too much trouble. Yeah, I got vague recollections of some folklore about a mysterious colony ship. You feeling a bit flushed? Look, why don't you go set yourself down in the corner before you get all tangle-footed? Tangle-footed? Yeah, 
Yeah, let me not let me not push this too much. Do want to talk to her again. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm contractually obligated to recite company slogans to any visitors. We'll get you mostly drunk at half the price. Spacer's choice. <laughs> okay. Let's see what you got. Coming right up. Got some dehydrated water. Mmm. Plain and pure water. 99% water. So what's the rest? What's the 1%? Hmm. Okay. Got energy brew. And trip teas. Ha <laughs> instead of strip teas. That's clever. Um... Let's not buy anything right now. So I need to find that guy. Can we go through this door? Hey oh. Just a bathroom. Okay. This door is locked. Okay. What's going on over here? to see here just stay at your post lady i'm looking around i'm not doing nothing i'm totally not stealing oh that's nice is this where she lives do you think mr ouch I thought it was nice, but look at that bed. Those pillows are like nothing. Balcony, though, okay. All right, let's move on. Fine, Mr. Thompson. Never been healthier. Oh, here's Abernathy. The little special case. Well, uh, did, uh, did Mr. Thompson send you? Well, you tell Mr. Thompson I'll be right at my post. Tomorrow. Uh, bright and early tomorrow. Because I'm definitely not plagued. As spry as a spring chicken. <laughs> That's old Abernathy. What you muttering to yourself, but I definitely want to use perception. I feel like that gets me more experience. So let's do that. You want to tell me what's going, what's got you so nervous there, boy? You some sort of wandering alienist? Walking into a man's own domicile, pestering him about his mental state? It didn't get me experience. Guess it didn't work. So you're Martin Abernathy, huh? What? No. I mean, uh, I might be. That depends on who's asking. I'm not looking for trouble. Just here to collect gravesite fees there, boy. Silas knows, doesn't he? That's why he sent you. That's why he wants me to pay up. He knows. He told me everything. How long do you think you could keep a secret like that, huh? Sounds like he's already told you. You may as well hear it from me. I'm dying. I'm not long for this world. The date of my expiration is fast approaching. And soon I shall be ushered through the great cannery in the skies. It's plague. Has to be. 
Silas knows. He knows I got one foot in my grave, and now he wants to charge me for the other one. <laughs> it's funny, they charge by the foot. Sorry to hear that, you're being paranoid. I'm sure it's all very tragic. I'm sure it's all very tragic and heartbreaking. Pay me so I can get out of here. I feel bad for the guy. You are? Oh, wow. First time anyone's ever told me that. I'll pay your fees. I don't want any trouble from Silas. But if you could see a way to freelancing for me, I could really use the help. Okay. How can I help? How do you think I'm a freelancer? Depends on what you need. You can't afford me. Again, I feel bad for the guy. Let's see how we can help. There's a cache of anthracillin tucked away in the old community center. Powerful stuff. Stronger than what we got, anyway. I need you to break in, nab that medicine, and bring it back to me. Hmm. I could do that. I don't want to ask questions. Nah. I'll just do You'll it. oblige me with your haste. I think I feel the plague spreading. Oh, Lord, it's in my spleen now. I can feel it. Anything I should know about this community center? You're taking awful risks trusting me, you know. Is there anything I should know? Just keep your head down when you're in there. Marauders have taken over. I ain't worried about them. Probably tracking mud all over the archives. And people do not like marauders, but not for the reasons you would think. So I don't like them because they're unemployed. This guy doesn't like them because they have dirty boots. Funny people. All right, Mr. Abernathy. I'll just leave you to your. You're mirror. making a mistake working for Abernathy. You got something to say, Esther? Excuse me, I'm Esther Blaine, Spacer's Choice Actuary. I overheard your talk with Abernathy. I hope you're not thinking about getting him that medicine. Abernathy is a well-known hypochondriac. Anthracillin is wasted on him. You're better off selling it to me instead. What do you need it for? He's got symptoms or something, you're saying it's psychosomatic. What do you need it for? I probably shouldn't tell you. Don't want you implicated for what I'm trying to do. You let me worry about that. All right. Here's a summary. A lot of sick people in this town, and we don't have the medicine to treat them all. Can't reach out to corporate without crossing a river of red tape, so I'm reaching out to you. Hmm. Paying me, can you match this offer? I get it, you need someone to smuggle medicine. <sighs> Something like that. Look, I'm not in the habit of law breaking, but sometimes you've got to do the wrong thing for the right reasons. I'll think about That's it. That's all I can ask of you. Hmm. Interesting. So we have some choices here. Wanted people. These, maybe these are the deserters. Been eating nothing but salt tuna for a year. Just the way it goes, I suppose. Hello. Pretty Welcome sure you to the owe Space me some money. Constabulary. We are Halcyon's leading brand in frontier justice. The office is writing up promotion. Purchase three criminal investigations, and the fourth one's free. Oh, maybe she doesn't owe me money. As long as your questions fall within the acceptable margins of curiosity. The acceptable margins of curiosity? Oh, this place is terrible. His likeness decorates many a wanted poster. Do you have any relevant information about this individual? Nope. <laughs> That's what I'm asking. Yeah, let's just be honest. Mm-hmm. Shot you into space. You know, lying to a Spacer's Choice Constable is a violation of company policy and punishable by a fine. It's a good thing I don't belong to the Spacer's Choice family. It is for Spacer's Choice. 
Unfortunately, the Rude. arrest of Mr. Wells falls outside my authority. I enforce the company policy as Spacer's choice in the region of Emerald Vale. Wells is wanted by the board. If you have information related to the location of Phineas V. Wells, you are required to submit that information to your nearest board authority. As I tell everyone else, I do what I want. Something to report? No, it won't work. Know how to carry yourself in a fight? I've got bounties out for these three marauders. Cross them off and bring me their fingers. Just one per marauder, please. I'll dust off the old fingerprint roller. All right. Guess so. All right. Bounty records. Let's open the bounties. Why is he wanted? Some of you may remember. Doesn't really say. Or for three counts of larceny. Okay. Alrighty. Sometimes I wonder what I'm doing with myself. Nothing I can do about that. This is a mechanic. Can we get our piece here? Here, hello. Hmm. Any modification? Ooh, okay, modification, Mr. Ouch. Hello? Is anybody home? Just here to steal some stuff. Unless you're home, then I kind of want to talk. Bathroom. Some sort of game board. Interesting that it's not telling me that I'm stealing any of this stuff. This is definitely somebody's house, and I am taking their stuff. But it's not considered stealing, so like, does this person, is this person dead? Does nobody live here, and they just haven't looted, like, just a 
is making sense. Did he lose her, her daughter? His daughter? That sucks. Lost his daughter. Wonder why. Wonder if it's more than just that. This company sucks. Hey, you hear about Wilson? Heard Marauder's gone in. Just between us. Wilson deserted. Lost his nerve. Ran off in the thick of night. You're kidding me. Damn. Always thought he was made of sterner stuff. I think he was plagued. Guess he didn't want to die in the sick house. Plagued? Ah, oh, shit. I had some of the soul to the... You moron. Alright, let's see what's going on. Anything back here? That's where I need to go. This place is giant. Alright guys. I think I'm gonna cut it there for now. Next time we'll uh we'll explore the the cannery and uh see what's going on. So, as always, uh, if you like this video, please like, subscribe. Yeah, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, uh, comment if you have anything, you know, that I'm, that you want me to do differently, or, you know, if you have any other game suggestions, I'm, I'm open to game suggestions as well. Um, otherwise, uh, I'll see you on the next one. All right, bye.